In the first video in this series, I told you the Gospel of Luke is all about the fact that anyone can find salvation. Well, one of the ways the author of Luke gets that point across is through the character of Jesus. Let's be honest, there's not a single gospel that has anything bad to say about Jesus. He's the master Christian, the most godly man to have ever walked this earth. But Jesus' character in Luke is especially compassionate. Over and over, Luke features Jesus' benevolence towards the weak, the suffering, and the outcast. In other words, towards absolutely anyone in need of salvation. For example, Luke 7 records Jesus as encountering a widow whose only son had died. Here's how the Bible describes what happened next. And when the Lord saw her, he had compassion on her and said unto her, weep not. And he said, young man, I say unto thee, arise. And he that was dead sat up and began to speak and he delivered him to his mother. Not only is this healing unique to Luke, but it emphasizes those two things we've been talking about. Jesus' humanity and the idea that no one is left out of salvation. The same thing goes for Jesus' healing of the woman who had been crippled for 18 years. She had two strikes against her. She was a woman, and Jesus happened to see her on the Sabbath, a day when work was forbidden according to Jewish law. But Jesus' compassion was so great that he healed her immediately, even though it made the ruler of the synagogue angry. Even Jesus' relationship with his disciples is portrayed differently in Luke than it is in the other Gospels. In Mark, for example, Jesus can sometimes seem impatient with his disciples' hard-headedness and lack of understanding. Not so in Luke. Though Jesus can be firm with his disciples, he also shows extraordinary patience and compassion. That's a reminder to his present-day followers that no matter what our failings, we are worthy of salvation too. <laughs> 